came in the game with my own. I ain't need a hand. Pops left your boy y'all alone. Had to be a man. Now nah, that I'm grown, yeah, it's on. I can feed the fam. Had the chase going on flights like Peter Pan. Man, man, slow down, boy. You're moving too fast. Yo, two, welcome back to the page, man. It's your boy Dot. I got a special video today, man. Yes, your boy is super pumped because I got a shoe that I really, 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 really wanted. And I had opportunity to get it for retail and I missed out, but God is so good. The universe is so good. The world is so good. Life is just so good to your boy because there's this thing called the law of attraction and there's this energy you can put out. And when you put that energy out, you get it back, man. And pretty much everything your boy want, he gets because I'm just that type of person. Like I won't sleep until I get it and I think about it. I fantasize about things, whatever it is, whether it's like this shoe I'm talking about today, whether it's a car, whether it's a girl, whether it's some money, whatever it is, I just focus on it and voila, I get it. So let's get into this, man. So two weeks ago, your boy did a trade on Trade Block and shout out to the boy Mac Man for trade needs. He actually reached out to me and initiated the trade and he asked me for a shoe that I was probably wasn't going to trade. It was actually like the first shoe that I ever won on the sneakers app, which is crazy because all of the business I do with Nike, you would think I'd have won before that. But nevertheless, he reached out to me. I couldn't refuse the deal because I didn't think it was going to be easy for me to get this shoe no other way. So I just went on ahead and did it. And I'm happy I did it. And we about to get into it. And the deal ended up being a two-for-one trade. And I would do it again. I would do it with another shoe um, because it wasn't no way I wasn't going to get this shoe. I was willing to pay that $1,000 ticket. Like, I was really contemplating, like, should I just do it now? Because I know they're going to go up and things like that. But they actually dipped down and they went back up. But it don't even matter because your boy... Try that again. Got him. So here they go. And as you can see, we have that black Mambo on the logo. And the colorway reads Kobe 6 Pro Tro, size 11 and a half. This is your boy's personal pair. And opening the lid, we do got that postcard from trade block and it just has this standard paper and let's take these things out the box yeah man yes sir i've been waiting on these things man these are special man these are special man if you know me you already know your boy is a kobe fan you can see the poster in the back Kobe. It's always been Kobe for your boy. It ain't never been LeBron. No disrespect to Brian. It ain't never really been Jordan. No disrespect to the GOAT. Because Kobe was closer to me in age. He was closer to us. Kobe was our guy. Kobe came in the league. 17 majors doing his thing. And he showed up and showed out. So I definitely had to get these pairs in my hand. And this is the Kobe 6 Pro Tro, the Mamba Cita, the Mamba mentality. Y'all know what it is. Man, shout out to Nike for releasing this pair, man. Shout out to this pair dedicated to the family, to Kobe, to his daughter, Gigi. As we can see right off the bat, you just see that number two and that gold just popping. It's Gigi Bryant's number that she wore on her jersey. And the black and white represents the uniform colors that she had wore. You got your black on the upper with your white Nike check. You got the zoom going around the bottom of the midsole with the black. And you also have that all white outsole with the black Mamba logo on there as well. And it has an extra pair of laces that's black with the white tips. The white laces that's coming in it 
has white laces with the black tips. You do have that Mamba logo on the tongue, on the inside. It has Mamba Cedar and it has the number two. And this is a representation of Kobe's daughter. And you have that black and white uh, print on the inside. On the back, you got the Mamba Cedar logo. That is for Gigi. And these represent her Sweet 16. Sweet 16. As you can see, you got Kobe on the left and Gigi on the right. These are beautiful. This is a beautiful shoe, man. This is a clean shoe, man. I really, really wanted these so bad. The crazy thing is, I actually got exclusive access on Sneakers app, and I never had exclusive access. I always seen people talk about it, always heard people talk about it. I never got it, so I never knew anything about it. But when these was releasing, I remember watching the YouTuber talk about these was gonna be released like in California, and I thought it was like a California only exclusive. But when I looked into the details and checked it out, after I got my notification, that I had the exclusive access. By the time I clicked on it, all pairs were sold out and your boy was crushed. But then I saw it said it was access for people to get them in the stores in California. And then certain members had exclusive access on the sneakers app. I just so happened to be one of those guys who had the access, but wasn't, uh, you know, on time to capitalize. But it's all good because your boy actually caught these. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about these Kobe Six Pro Troll Mamba C, the Mamba mentality, man. These are fire in your boy's personal opinion. No, I would never sell these shoes. They're gonna be up there right next to them Grinches. Um, I just can't sell nothing, Kobe. That's just disrespectful to me. I know a lot of people um, capitalizing on your boy Death and all of that, but I cannot do that because of what he meant to the culture, what he meant to the sneaker community, what he meant to us as young black men, all of that good stuff. I just can never, like, it's not even a thought to even, no, we ain't doing that, but yeah. So y'all let me know about the trade though. So I actually traded, what did I trade? I traded my Travis Scott sixes and I traded a pair of the uh, Rebellionaires. I actually had two pair of Rebellionaires, so it actually worked out. So I really only gave up my Travis Scott sixes in my eyes, which is a no brainer to, swap those out for these i do it again every trip every trip so y'all leave me a comment man let me know how y'all feel about these let me know if y'all got these let me know if y'all got these on exclusive access let me know how y'all feel about people selling kobe's and all that type of stuff like i ain't knocking it because it's a lot of money that people being made uh people making but i just can't do that i'm just too real for that type of uh energy but yeah so make sure y'all subscribe to the channel man hit that notification bell Get his the biggest thumbs up, man. And keep rocking with your boy. And until next time, man, y'all be safe. Y'all be blessed. And your boy, Dot, I am out. Slow down, boy, you're moving too fast. They told me when I used to move it through class. Yeah, they know me. Your OGs owe me. Back in the day, ain't good like Kobe.